I had heard on the news that the food pantries were getting depleted by like 90%. I said, there's got to be something that we can do. It had been quiet, <sighs> even a little lonely circling the pen since the quarantine. <laughs> when it came to her, what if she made a drive-up show? Something legendary for a can of soup. I don't want to charge admission during this time with so many people being unemployed, mm. but we could accept the food donations. <laughs> By that weekend, cars lined the dusty drive a quarter mile deep. This past Sunday, we had 171 cars come through. To see the unicorn in a field of horses. Oh, cute. Now this isn't enough. The kids, they were peering out, of, you know, standing up out of uh, sunroofs, and they're hanging out of the car windows. They're telling their mom and dad, oh, Look, it's a real unicorn. She's really wanting to show you guys a little trick. The spiraled horned beauty captivating kids by the car load while filling the trough with food. People even brought huge bags of food. They'd bring like reusable bags with huge jars of peanut butter and tuna fish and soup and beans and yeah, it's, it's been awesome. A mystical horse yielding thousands of donations for the Wakanda Island Lake Food Pantry down the road. We do get a few skeptics who say, is that a real unicorn? Woo! To which we say, do you believe it's a real unicorn? And every time, yes. There's a saying that it takes belief in magic, however small, for any world to survive. In Wakanda, a unicorn is helping to feed a community. Good girl, Nikki! And that's nothing short of magical. So, if you want a glimpse of that legendary creature, it's going to have a show. They're going to have a show there at Foundations Farm every Wednesday and every Sunday. Uh, and so we're going to post a link on my Facebook page with the hours, directions, everything you need to know. Because who doesn't want to see a unicorn? You want to see a unicorn? Yeah! Yeah, show a little more excitement next time, okay? <laughs> <laughs>